You're... What's good, y'all? It's me, your host, Javier, is back in the building. Welcome to another episode of... It's Spider-Man, baby! I... am excited. <laughs> As you... Well, to my day one of the shot collars being in the gym, shooting three-pointers, being on that side, popping that collars, what it do? And two. The ones here today, but gone tomorrow. We've enjoyed our time. Maybe next time with no sorrow. And as you all remember, I beat this game. So now, the storyline of the game. So now I'm just enjoying the game, what's left over. Cleaning it up, you know. No, oh, that was anticlimactic. She's okay. That was the Sandman's daughter. More, though. We Maybe just put that crystal later, together. To bring this family together again. And that's the statue of him holding her. I wonder if I can still see it though. Right? Yeah. Here it is. That's kind of cool. Cause I was seeing the pieces and I was like, "What does it all this do?" But yeah, no, nah, this is what they all do. I wake up in some kind of dungeon. Lots of empty cells around. You're not here. But are you okay? I completed that. He got a new one? What was the new one?
at your own risk. Now the fun really starts. Playing from Ortavius's MacBook Pro. Here at Waybear. Now through November 27th, get up to eight. <laughs> I got a fat slug to me, my fat Deep. 
Hitting the ground. You just like to have a nugget in the floor and not even care. You just look at it like, oh well. <laughs> I've got 99 problems, but a nugget's not one. So many nuggets, dude. I had so many. I felt like a kid. You don't have a shower, you have to have many nuggets. I would see homeless people. I was like, oh, thank you, nugget, you peasant. Feed your family for these nuggets. Nugget for you, nugget. Sauces. Really, McDonald's? Come on, man. I can't go back to a six piece. You're having six nuggets. You know what? You son of a bitch. <laughs> you clearly see I have six nuggets. They asked you for a sixth okay. of my meal. Would you like a kidney as well? I have two of those. I wanted to go to a strip club so bad for those <laughs> nuggets, man. <laughs> How great would that be if you could feed the strippers, right? They dance and all of a sudden, nugget, like, oh, I jump out. Like in SeaWorld, that'd be so cool, man. I got in trouble at McDonald's the other day, dude. You guys ever check your bag while you're at the window before you leave just to make sure the shit's in it, right? I was checking the other day and the lady saw me checking. She's like, what, you don't trust me? And I'm like, no, I don't. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm like, you don't trust me. There's a reason I gotta pay in the first window and not the second window. It's like a That's jump me. deal, right? You go to the first window, they're like, give me the money. Well, homie's got the bag with the shit. Second window, go! I'm gonna see you again, just get out of here! Did you go to second window, guy? Second window, guy? Not as smart as first window, guy. You ever ask the second window, guy, the first window, guy question and they freak out, dude? Next time you're in the second window, be like, hey, can I add a soda? And they're like, oh. <laughs> we're like, just take it, get out of here. Right? They just give me this shit, man. The worries is that when you go to the second window and they don't have your food ready, they're like, you pull for it and push over the fast food timeout, man. Fast food timeout. Ordered some weird shit. I almost like it when I know. I know when it's something free, that's the best. I go and cock him too. I'll be like, excuse me, you forgot my fries. They're like, oh sir, have a soda while you wait. I'm like, that will not do. I had a lot of plans today, and you know what? Just give me McClurry and we'll call it even. They're like, whoa, this fuck is this one. Hey, chill out. I'll put you up on her, I'll pass the whole titty when I get up. I'll 
chips left when you get home. I'm at work making the money to buy the chips and you gonna eat all the shit up? I set this house on fire. <laughs> I got six bags of salt and vinegar chips right now in my cabinet. Don't nobody want this shit. I open the cabinet and get mad and slam it. She look, I'm like, this is your goddamn fault. <laughs> that vasectomy, baby. Team leave it in over here. Leave that thing right up in there. I love it, man. They call you a couple days prior to the procedure to tell you like how to prepare for it. They called me, you know, and I was ready. I was ready for this shit. I was like, Mr. Moore, you can't take any blood thinners 48 hours before the procedure. I was like, cool, no aspirin. I drink water from a headache. Fuck it, what else? Let's go, let's go. They was like, you gotta take a shower too. I was like, duh, bitch. <laughs> Somebody did that, right? Somebody walked in after a 10-hour shift, grabbed their balls and threw them at the doctor and was like, do your work. Hmm. That's the only reason they would have to say that. Top three gifts you can get your man right now for 25% off at manscaped.com. Number one, the Lawn Mower 5.0 Ultra. This upgraded full body trimmer now features two interchangeable heads and seven different guard lengths, so he can trim it exactly the way he wants. Number two, the Buff Bundle. It features the body buffer, an antibacterial silicone body scrubber that is going to be a huge upgrade from his crusty loofah. And it comes with two bottles of body wash that smell amazing and have cologne quality fragrance. Number three, the Boxers 2.0. These are super comfortable and are going to be the perfect stocking stuffer. Shop now and get free shipping at manscaped.com before it's too late. Your health is your biggest asset. Find Anthem Blue Cross plan starting at zero dollars a month. Apply in five to ten minutes for a secure future at healthforcalifornia.com. And and you can see me smiling in the picture. So even if you want to get mad, you can't. You're like, who the fuck is this handsome ass nigga? Bitch, look, period. That's how I like my shit, boy. I shave my shit. Normally it takes me like 12, 15 minutes to get my shit together. I'm a pro at this shit, right? But because it was going to be a new audience, I took my time. I wanted to set the bar, that's what I wanted to do. So I went in the living room, I brought my best lamp from the living room in the bathroom. <laughs> Took the shade off of it. I put on some Sade's, sweetest taboo, kiss of life. You do your best cleaning with Sade's on, you take your time with it. I lit some candles, it was intimate. I did this part first, mm, got that together, right? So then I got to my ball, I put a ponytail over it around my ball. Hear me out. Every guy here knows that 
that shady ball, you just try to hold it with your hands. You know, it's always one unruly ball that just like flies out. Like he just going around the set. You keep clipping him, but the killing him with him. But you stay your ass in there. You don't have that problem with the whole thing. Okay. 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 I bet you're wishing that cloaking tech hadn't failed right now. Super 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 Save your applause for later. Don't think shit about the fuck. Not the fuck away. Because I want to look for a problem here, but at least acknowledge it, right? At least acknowledge the work. Because I didn't just shave my balls. I went down to the side and I just right here. I take the hair on my inner side. I can put a part on this side. Like you see the effort. Nice to know even hunters have trouble with their tech. But the worst sleeper on earth? The snorer. I know some of y'all in here right now, I can tell. I can see your bellies and I can see it in your nose. You snore! You snore, don't you, sir? I knew it! I can see it! Look at her face, she's like, he knew! Watch this, clap if you ever fell asleep with someone who snores. See how hard she clapped? Because he snores now. Snores are unconscious jerks. Here's the fact about all snores. They always fall asleep first. You ever notice that? Snores never let you fall asleep. As soon as they lay down, it's the worst sound you've ever heard in your life. If you've never slept with a snore, you should be good. But if you have, you know what I'm going through. And we have achieved so all you hear is... Hopefully this bird's data helps me figure out what's going on here. They definitely take after their mama. Avoid him. Suit can't handle the heat. Bullets and spiders. Not a good combo. Mama Bird is about to be very angry. Get back in the slipstream and catch up! And that's the last one. Not too talented, if you ask me. Really? 
they sit here? Alright y'all, about to go play another game. As always, I hope you've enjoyed your time with me as I've enjoyed my time with you. And until next time, but that is on God's time, but I hope you enjoy the rest of your time while there is time. Alright y'all, God bless. Take care of yourselves. One.